Hi, I'm Valder Beebe, and I host the Valder Beebe Show on FM radio and internet television. I am famously known for that celebrity interview, which I conduct by cell phone, in studio, or satellite media tours. Go to ValderBeebeShow.com, YouTube.com slash Show, or our partnership network with Business in the Black, which is BlackSuccessAcademy.com, and click on the Valder BB Show channel. I'll see you there. Darren Starr and Miriam Shore, thank you so very much for joining us. I, I want to get to Younger right away on TV Lane. You know, season three ended in turmoil. Now we're back for season four. What can we expect? Let's start with you, Darren, since you're claiming that producer's title. Oh, I'm claiming it all right. <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, there is, a, there is uh, a lot of mess that Liza has to deal with in season four. And I think that, uh, you know, she and... Um, you know, we're going to find out how Kelsey deals with this bombshell that she drops on her at the end of season three. All right, then. Okay, so, Miriam, what's the bombshell? Tell Listen, me. Listen, I, I, so, so Liza has told Kelsey at the end of, of season three, and what I love about the writing is that the writers have not let Liza off the hook, that she, ha there, there are consequences for this lie. There's consequences for how she's been living her life. And while it may, may have been fun and a, a wonderful journey for her, She's hurting the people who love her and who are close to her, and that's gonna ha there's gonna be repercussions, and that's kind of what the start of season four is, and I, I admire that because I, I think a, a lot of other shows might take the easy way out and just keep it fun light, and this is really showing you that there are consequences to your actions. Yeah, okay. I mean the show. Yeah, the show really does deal with thematically, you know, the consequences of telling a small lie and sort of how that can sort of just metastasize into something that really affects people and but Darren isn't that 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 shaky ground because everybody lies these days look at true. look look at our just our society well you know that's we're yeah. very in the zeitgeist right now we're in the post-truth and we <laughs> deal with that a lot in the first episode it's we, great we have a, a I'm glad somebody's taking it on it really oh yeah is, you we're know, dealing trying to hold my kids accountable but you know right. society says it's okay I yep. like this well the first episode very much delves into all of that and sort of this idea of what is truth and can we create an alternative set of facts about ourselves? Can we say who the uh, guest Christian, star is? Oh, yeah. Um, Christian Jenoweth plays, I guess people would might say she plays a Kellyanne Conway-like character who is, pitching, who is pitching a book to the publishing company. Yeah. Yeah, this idea that, that truth is what you make of it as opposed to just truth. Yeah. I, lo I love Kristen. Oh, she, my God. She's really going to bring a lot she to is, what you have, have yeah. brought to life on the pages. Let me ask you guys. You guys are in this great successful, uh, award-winning series. H how do you take it to the next level? You told me some of the details, but how do you take it to the next level? How do you be better than yourself? I have to say, this season is our best season yet. Yeah, and and sure. I think we all feel that way. The, the, I think the characters get deeper. We learn more about all the characters, and I think the stories get more complex, and I, I, I feel like the, uh, the, the journey feels really organic and, much, and in a way, um, more involving this season. Yeah, and you know, that's the great thing about being able to st tell stories on television is that you can explore uh, angles and, and, and parts of a character that you can't in, in say, just a, a film because you have such a limited time. And, and each character, I feel like, just you open up their lives and kind of explore a little bit more. I know for my character, Diana, you really went into her personal life and it's fascinating. <laughs> Well, you guys are fascinating. It's called Younger. It's on TV Land. I've been following it a bit. So you guys tune in because it's really, really about life. You may see some of your family on, the, on Younger because it <laughs> represents right. who we are. Darren, let me ask you. It's on TV Land. When do you want us to watch? 10 p.m. tonight. Wednesday nights. 
We'll be there. And by the way, we guys. now and now you can binge the first three seasons on Hulu. Yes. Oh, don't we? We're, we're now addicted to binge. Listen, so binge right. watch it. Get a pint of ice cream and binge eat while you binge watch. Binge those first three seasons on Hulu. If you haven't seen it, and then come back and watch season four on TV Land. <laughs> Please come back because I know season four is going to be great. It is. I want to come. I want you to come back and talk about the great accolades and the great writing. I like your writing for your show. Thank it's you. Amazing. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you for being my guest on the Valder Beebe Show. Oh, it's been my pleasure. pleasure. Thank, Thank you. you.